Dietary sodium restriction is endorsed by the current guidelines as a mechanism to prevent future outcomes, although this is not uh, supported by strong clinical evidence. The sodium HF study presented at the uh, ACC Congress was designed to assess the effect of dietary sodium restriction to less than 1.5 gram of sodium per day on cardiovascular related hospital admissions and all cause mortality, quality of life, and uh, exercise capacity. The study included 841 patients with uh, heart failure uh, defined by the uh, clinician without any cutoff for left ventricular ejection uh, fraction. And the study demonstrated that there was no difference whatsoever on the primary outcome of mortality, hospitalizations, or not uh, between the two different groups, no difference in the individual components of the primary outcome. There was no difference in exercise capacity, and there was a, only a modest effect on uh, quality of life. Therefore, in uh, the, the sodium HF demonstrated that in ambulatory patients with uh, heart failure, a dietary intervention to reduce sodium to less than 1.5 grams per day does not reduce clinical event as a very modest effect a benefit on uh, uh, quality of life and, and no effect on uh, uh, exercise capacity. This has, uh, um, uh, should lead us to rethink our strategy of sodium restriction in patients with heart failure.